Hey guys, Dusty here. With the holidays right around the corner, I thought I'd share with you my 10 stocking stuffer ideas for runners. Number one on my list is Gooder sunglasses. I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with this brand. These sunnies are relatively inexpensive. They're polarized, no slip. They come in a bunch of different colors, styles, and Gooders are always a great gift idea for runners. Number two on my list is a no-brainer. Uh, might be kind of boring, but every runner needs them, and that is socks. So there's a couple of brands that I always go to. Uh, brand number one is Darn Tough. Uh, they have a lifetime warranty. They all have a merino wool blend in them. And then my all-time favorite running sock is the Features No-Show tab, uh, the light cushion option. So they're durable, they're very comfy, and I like the compression that they provide around my arch. So socks aren't the most exciting gift, but runners appreciate them, we always need them, and they're number two on my list. Number three on my list is basically any recovery tool. Uh, for the purpose of this video, I'm gonna show a roller. This is called the Contour uh, Stick from Trigger Point. Um, something like this is a great option for a runner if they don't have any recovery tools or even like a basic foam roller. Uh, Trigger Point makes really nice foam rollers. So if you know any runners, they don't have any recovery tools or they're always getting injured, um, some sort of recovery tool like a, like a stick or a foam roller is a great gift idea. Number four on my list is toe spreaders. Now these ones are from the brand Half Moon. These are called the Joya Toes Toe Spreaders. These ones come in two sizes, small and large. I have a pair of the large ones and I'll typically use them every other night. I put them on for about 30 minutes before I go to bed. And they're just gonna help open up your toes, provide a nice stretch. Um, and as a runner, I think uh, toe flexibility and toe strength is really important and is a great gift idea for a stocking stuffer. Number five on my list could be good for your runner if there's someone who runs in the dark all the time. That is something high vis, so you can get these little, um, might be hard to see on the camera. These are just like little clip-on lights. They're relatively inexpensive, awesome stocking stuffer idea. Kind of maybe a step up from that would be like a, like a running vest, almost like a safety vest vest, but designed for runners. A headlamp's always a good idea, and then the king of high visibility would be a Vizzy vest. So I'll put some footage up on the screen of me in my Vizzy vest. Uh, this thing is awesome. I feel super safe running in the dark whenever I have my Vizzy vest on. And something high viz is coming in at number five on my list. Next up on my list, we might have something that's even more lame than socks, and that is uh, sports detergent. So I personally use sports suds. So if you're buying for a runner or athlete who has a ton of athletic wear, it could be a good idea to get them some sort of sports wash to help them preserve the life of some of that apparel. Number seven on my list is something that I use every single time I go trail running by myself, and that is the Nathan uh, Ripcord Siren. So this little tiny device has a clip on the back. Uh, I just clip it onto my waist when I'm running. It's really lightweight, it weighs basically nothing. And if you're ever in danger and need to sound the alarm, you just pull the bottom out here, and then to quiet the alarm, you just push it back in. If I go running on the trails by myself, it's often in areas where there's known to be black bears and cougars, and it just gives me a huge peace of mind knowing uh, more than likely this would scare away one of those animals if I did come across one. And I do know a couple of other runners, this has saved them from dogs actually. So awesome stocking stuffer idea, I believe it only comes in at $20 Canadian, so pretty cheap as well. Next up on my list is a storage belt from Nathan. So obviously it just fits around your waist. Um, this one is called the Mirage Pack Plus. I have one in black and if I ever go out for a run and my shorts don't have a pocket for my phone, I'll often take this. Um, so it, it comes with two pockets, this big one in the front. Uh, it will fit most phones. So myself, I have a Google Pixel 6, that's a pretty big phone and mine will fit in there no problem. And then it also has this smaller pouch which I can easily fit credit cards, cash, a key in there. And best of all, when I cinch this belt up super tight, I get very minimal bounce, even having that big phone in that front pocket. Number nine on my list is something a runner will always appreciate, and that is running nutrition. So there's endless options when it comes to gels and gummies, um, electrolyte tabs, recovery powders, carb drinks. You could find out what it is your runner likes and get them more of that 
or you could branch out and maybe get them some new flavors or maybe some new some new gummies. The Martin Gels, uh, there's only two of them. There's regular and caffeinated. They've been really popular in the running community and you definitely can't go wrong with nutrition as a gift, especially if your runner does some longer stuff like half marathons or especially marathon distance racing. Number 10 on my list will depend on where you live, but if you live somewhere like I do where temperatures can get a bit colder, it could be wise to get some cold weather accessories. So that could be like a running beanie or running toque. You could get a buff or a neck warmer. Gloves are always a good option. I like the two-in-one, so they have the mitt glove combo. And honestly, I have some cold weather accessories that I've probably had for 10 years, and they still have plenty of life left in them. When you buy quality things, especially like these accessories for running, they will last you a very, very long time. So if your runner is out there running in the cold and snow, it could be a good idea to pick them up some cold weather accessories. So I hope that gave some of you some gift ideas for your runners out there. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe for more everything running. And like always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.